Hey there YouTube, here with a new Mario World hack, Akugari Mario World. Um, you may have seen other people play this, it's fairly popular. Um, I think it's supposed to be like beginner-ish, and then maybe towards the end it gets kind of hard, but not like Grand Poo World hard or anything. But uh, I've heard it's really well designed and a lot of fun, so I'm definitely excited to see what it is. Uh, but yeah, let's do it. Welcome to Akagari Mario World. I didn't write a story for this hack, but who reads those anyway? <laughs> okay, my timers are messed up. <clears throat> Let me fix that. Okay, <clears throat> sorry about that. Yoshi's Treehouse. Remember, you can hit select on the overworld to save any time. This can be used to save your death count. This hack uses some coin guides here and there. Blue coins are for spinning, others colors are for a, usually for a thrown object. Okay. Dude, I struggle reading those boxes because of the spacing. Bullet Promenade. And I'm dead. Rip the Deathless. Okay. Okay, so we land on that dude. Oh, I bet that's... Okay, I have to hit that hidden block. Okay. Ah... <laughs> uh. Those bullets just kind of appear out of nowhere. Oh. <sighs> that was close. Phew, okay, checkpoint. Nice, nice. Oh, I actually... I did that right, apparently. <laughs> I like this so far. <clears throat> okay, I need to do like a tiny jump there, I think. Yeah, re-grabs helped a lot with that part. Oh my goodness, how did I make that? <laughs> Are those fake cannons? Nice. Took two minutes on level one. It's pretty good, uh, not too bad. <clears throat> okay, what we got next? Super Koopa Hills. Is this a shell level? The legend says the butt... Oh, so slide. Gotcha. Got it. Uh, so one thing in Mario World that now I can actually talk about. Oh, I need to slide into that guy. I can actually talk about this in reference to Mario Maker, because Mario Maker 2 now has slopes as well. Um, in Mario World, there's a certain max speed that you can run at, and it's P-speed. Um, but things like being slide... Things like sliding on a slope or being shot out of a light pipe, I guess you'd call it. Um, that puts your speed past that. And the way the game handles that is... Oh, shoot, that's a spin. For whatever reason, they put... So if you're holding left or right, they put checks to make sure you're not going above that P-speed. Uh, value. But it only does it while you're holding left or right. So if you're not holding those, it doesn't check your speed. And I can float at really high speeds as long as I want, as long as I don't like land and, you know, make the speed go down. 
<clears throat> but if I press right in the air, uh, Mario will suddenly become a lot slower. And in Mario Maker, that's not a thing. Uh, slopes just give you... Well, it changes a little bit, but it's basically slopes are the same speed as running for the most part. There's some tiny differences that you would only notice in a really high level setting. Whoa, I don't know how I lived through that, but I'll take it. <laughs> I thought I was dead, I took my hand off the controller. Okay, got some control jumps there. I don't know how I landed on that green bean. That was crazy. Also in this game, while you are sliding, you're near invincible. Uh, there's not much that can kill you. Um, let's see. Munchers can kill you. That may be it, honestly. Like, <laughs> you can, uh... You could, if you're sliding, you'll kill a saw. It's kind of nuts. That's how I'm killing these piranhas in midair. Yeah. I don't know why I jumped off Yoshi there. That was not a very good play. <laughs> Get out of here, buddy. Four and a half minutes? Not bad. That was definitely harder than stage one, but not too much harder. This is definitely not like intro, like this is much harder than something like Quickie World so far. Uh, Clune a Cavern. That's probably talking about Clune Dog, who has disappeared off the face of the earth. I'm very surprised I got that. <laughs> I'm so bad at timing the fireballs or potabos, whatever. I feel so weird calling them that. They're fireballs to me. But at the same time, I think the thing Mario shoots is a fireball, so. Wow, that was quick. <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> I kinda wish we had bats in Mario Maker, they're pretty cool. We don't really have an enemy that has a pattern like that. The like swooping down thing. Oh wow, so, okay. There we go. I was, uh, I don't know. Okay. I didn't know that thing would kill the skull platform. Wow. <laughs> nice jump. really bad. Whoa, dude, what the heck? Get that out of here. Okay. Are we in there? Don't kill me. an innocent little troll. Like, oh my god, it's a spike top. <laughs> that was fun, I really like that level. 
I, uh, I always enjoy bats. Oh, two exits. The toxic passage. Alright, so the timers, we're gonna get both exits here. I didn't know that fish was coming. Okay, I think I want to hit him, then go. I don't think that's going to work. This is probably the secret exit. Is that a checkpoint? It is, okay. Yeah, I imagine this is the secret exit. So remember, I can't press left or right, because if I do, the game's going to check my speed and be like, whoa, he's going way too fast, he's got to slow down. Uh, you can see it on the input display. I'm actually not even touching the D-pad. But I just realized the input display is not... Why is it not... Oh my god, it's because I had it minimized, sorry. I guess the I guess the input display hasn't been working, but it's working now. So you can see now that I'm not <laughs> not touching the D-pad. Before I wasn't touching anything. Whoa, a key jump. Okay, a little bit of a spike in difficulty, but I like it. Whoops. Okay, yeah, so I need to both jump and grab that key on the same frame. Do I need to be holding run? I don't even need to hold run, okay. I didn't know that. Okay, so I only need jump. Okay, that's the end. Alright, just do a re-grab off that Koopa dude. Come on. Nice, that was a pretty cool section. Uh, I didn't know that you didn't have to hold run. I always do. Alright, let's do the uh, regular exit. I already forgot this part. Yeah, I didn't forget it, never mind. <sighs> okay. <sighs> oh, come on. I only got hit by a troll. That one was hard to dodge. There we go. Now what? Okay, that's a pretty big jump. I don't have like no speed. No speed there. Nice fish. <clears throat> cool. That was eight minutes, but that was two exits. Most of the time, I think, was on the secret exit. I got wrecked. 
All right, let's do the uh, Tubba's Palace. Okay, that's a little slow there. I love when games mark the uh, invisible blocks. Like, I. I don't think an invisible block is a bad obstacle. I just hate that it's invisible. What is this? Oh, I barely made that. Alright, what's gonna happen in here? I'm ready. Am I already dead? Can I respawn that? I hope. <laughs> Please. Oh, I actually can. <sighs> I don't really know... I don't know that guy's movement. I didn't know when it was gonna jump. Alright, we got another chance. Yump! Two minutes, that was very quick. Did I try the palace corner? What does that even mean? I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what that's talking about. Anyway. Shiver Thorn Hollow. The purple looking... Oh, those are dangerous. Okay. I thought that was background. Purple looking... Piranha Dude, I'm dead. Oh, that's ice. I did not know that. <laughs> I just completely slid off of that thing. Oh, oh my god. What is that? Ah. Okay, jump up there. Oh my god, the ice physics. <laughs> nice. Sorry about that, Yoshi. Dude, this game's really fun so far. I am, uh, <clears throat> I'm enjoying these levels. Oh. Dude, I hate ice physics. <clears throat> I can make that gap, really. I didn't think I could get near far enough. Okay, I can. Oh my goodness. That was... <laughs> that was incredibly bad. Ah, these green beans, dude, I hate them. That was a fun level. Despite the ice physics. That's just a personal thing I dislike, though. Alright. Uh, I know that was kind of short, but that kind of feels like, you know, the end of World 1, you could say. 
I mean, we did one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, seven exits. So yeah, I think this is a good place to stop. Let me get back to where we were. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, I post one of these Mario World videos every Wednesday at 9 a.m. So if you like it, um, subscribe and check it out. But yeah, thanks so much and see you all next time.